Hello and welcome to our patient education series. Today we're focusing on left bundle branch block, commonly known as LBBB, a finding on an electrocardiogram or ECG. Now you might be wondering what exactly is an ECG? Well, an ECG is a straightforward painless test that records the electrical activity of your heart over a period of time. It's like a map of your heart's electrical system, showing the rhythm and rate at which your heart beats. This brings us to our main topic, left bundle branch block. The bundle branch part of the name refers to the bundle of his, a collection of heart muscle cells specialized for electrical conduction that transmit the electrical impulses from the atrioventricular node, a part of the heart's electrical system, to the point of the apex of the fascicular branches. The left in the name indicates the side of the heart affected by the block. In the simplest terms, LBBB occurs when the pathway that sends electrical signals to the left side of your heart is slowed or blocked. This can cause the left side of your heart to contract a bit later than it should. Now, hearing about a block might sound concerning, but here's something important to note. LBBB doesn't always indicate a heart problem. Some people have LBBB for years without any related health issues but it can be associated with other heart conditions, which is why it's essential to have regular checkups if you have been diagnosed with LBBB. In the next part of this series, we'll delve deeper into the causes and symptoms of LBBB, so stay tuned. But for now, remember, having a left bundle branch block can affect how your heart beats, but doesn't always indicate a heart problem. LBBB might be seen in perfectly healthy individuals. However, it can also be associated with heart diseases like hypertension, cardiomyopathy, or coronary artery disease. Essentially, this condition can occur when there's a delay or block in the electrical signals that stimulate the left side of your heart. This disruption can be the result of age-related changes, underlying heart diseases, or even certain medications. Now, it's important to note that many people with LBBB don't exhibit any noticeable symptoms. It's often discovered incidentally during a routine ECG. But for some, it may cause symptoms that can't be ignored. These might include fatigue, fainting, shortness of breath, or a feeling of discomfort in the chest. If you do experience symptoms like chest discomfort or shortness of breath, you should consult your doctor. Remember, it's always better to seek medical advice sooner rather than later when it comes to your heart health. Treating LBBB involves managing the underlying heart condition, if present. This might include medications, lifestyle changes, or other treatments as advised by your cardiologist. For instance, if the LBBB is due to high blood pressure, your healthcare provider may prescribe medications to lower it. On the other hand, if the cause is a heart condition like cardiomyopathy, additional treatments like surgeries or devices such as a pacemaker may be necessary. Now, you might wonder, how does one live with LBBB? Well, in many cases, LBBB doesn't significantly impact your everyday life. It's often a silent condition, discovered on a routine ECG, and doesn't necessarily mean you're in ill health. However, it's essential to monitor your heart health regularly. This might mean regular checkups with your healthcare provider and maintaining a heart-healthy lifestyle. What does a heart-healthy lifestyle entail? It's a combination of balanced nutrition, regular physical exercise, stress management, and refraining from harmful habits like smoking. A balanced diet rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, lean proteins, and low in saturated fats can support heart health. Regular physical activity, tailored to your ability and comfort level, can help to keep your heart strong and resilient. Stress management is another crucial aspect of heart health. Techniques such as mindfulness, meditation, yoga, or even hobbies that bring you joy can help in managing stress levels. And let's not forget, smoking is a no-go. It's harmful to your heart and overall health. So remember, Having LBBB doesn't mean your heart is unhealthy. It's a condition that requires understanding and management, not fear. With the right care, regular monitoring, and a heart-healthy lifestyle, you can lead a normal, active life. Always consult your healthcare provider for personalized advice. 